Hello, Gemini, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, today I think it'll be a partly cloudy and quiet day for the Geminis, believe it or not, with your heart toward legacy. It's the first day after the holidays. Hope you're having a good one. But today I think you'll find yourself to be a bit spaced out, really. Now, the moon is in Pisces, which means your heart is really thinking about legacy and career. In fact, in the last 24 hours, you might have had a test of faith when it came to what your legacy or career would be when the moon conjunct Uranus right in the middle of Christmas Day. That ultimately comes down to a test of faith in ourselves. So in that moment, you might have had to stand up for yourself, even though no one was looking, and believe in yourself, no matter what the circumstantial evidence might appear as. Your heart had to know that you were on the right path. Well, today that's calmed down, though your heart is still tied to career and legacy, and will be till it's about tomorrow. But the sun today is well into Capricorn. In fact, we can officially call it Chapter 1 of Capricorn. And for Geminis, this means you'll be getting a bit deeper with a long-term relationship. Now, last month, of course, it came down to coming to terms with whatever was preventing you from really connecting on a long-term level perspective with people. So that was romantic. That was also with business partnerships and also friendships. What prevents Geminis from getting engaged in LTRs in the first place? And hopefully, it came to some conclusion before Christmas about what the wound was, how you got on that path, and what you needed to do to fix it. Well, the universe is not letting off the pressure. In fact, today with the sun in Capricorn, it means that for the next 30 days, Geminis will be exploring what now prevents you from getting intimate with people. I mean, really intimate. This does not have to be sexual, but of course, sex does fall into this. So most likely, if you're not an LTR, you will at least attract a partner in the next 30 days because something will force you to rethink what prevents you from true intimacy and the laws of intimacy. And as we're here in the first chapter of Sun and Capricorn, you'll be uncovering all the things that aren't working for you on this level. So all I want you to do right now is to just take notes, Gemini, of everything not working on an intimate level for you or any hangups on someone that has passed away. It's another category rare, but does happen. All right, Gemini, that's all I have for Tuesday. See you tomorrow with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be. So